Good Tuesday morning, beautiful sunshine. Certainly looks like a nice, bright, cheery day. It is a very cold morning, though. Uh, we're getting just a few minutes away from 9 o'clock here on this Tuesday. Here's our Gwaltney Group camera from Grand Rounds. This is from South Broadway, looking to the south here in Rochester. And the, the sky is blue. It's Really cold morning. We've been as cold as two degrees this morning and we're on our way to the teens again later today. So we're looking at the temperatures warming up with the help of the sunshine, but it again will be an abnormally cold day. Temperatures running about 25 degrees colder than the seasonal average today. So for us, instead of the mid 40s, we would expect or even low 40s. Uh, we're looking at temperatures today in the teens once again for high temperatures. Pretty chilly for this time of the year. Probably the last of these really cold days. We're looking at temperatures beyond this moving up to more typical November levels, at least in the next couple of days. We'll eventually get there, uh, but first we do have to get through some midweek snow, and that's the big headline for tomorrow. And after today's near record cold, they had, we were about three degrees from the record low this morning, which was uh, one below zero. Uh, and then the record cold high temperature today would, would have been 11. We, uh, we're going to blow right past that in a couple hours. I think we'll be in the upper teens, so at least we can manage that, uh, avoiding the records, but coming too close, I think, forever anybody's uh, preference. But we're looking at a cold, sunny Tuesday, and then we'll look at some snow tomorrow. By this time tomorrow, we we'll may even be watching some uh, light snow falling from the skies above. But right now, mostly sunny. Here's a look from our studio to the south along Bandle Road in northwest Rochester, a Gwaltney Group camera. Uh, from Signal Hill, uh, this time yesterday we had that snow shower that came through and coated everything. A lot of that has, uh, has melted away, even though we've been below freezing, but uh, not nearly as, as white and bright as it was uh, after that snow shower brought about a tenth to two tenths of an inch of snowfall here to northwest Rochester on Monday. Today it's 70 degrees right now in Rochester, uh, 9 in Austin, 7 in Mason City, Cresco 7. Uh, looking at the conditions here in Rochester, uh, 2 below zero, the current wind chill, but the wind's pretty light. That will change as those winds will turn more to the south this afternoon. They'll begin to pick up just a little bit. Clouds will also thicken. So Day, uh, day of transition, though all around this is going to be a cold day. That's the one theme that we're following. But again, it's a day that we start seeing at least some changes toward something different. Two below the current wind chill in Rochester, nine above in Austin, where the wind is nearly calm, three below in Mason City, and five in Albert Lee. Mostly sunny at first, but watch those winds start to pick up. The clouds start to thicken. Look for high temperatures around 17 sunset. 447 and again between now and then we are going to see the winds pick up and here come the clouds from the northwest. Those are the storm system coming in out of British Columbia and out of Alberta, Canada. That's going to make its way in our direction over the course of the next 24 hours and eventually bring us uh, a little bit of snow. Not a huge system, but maybe an inch or two. Uh, cold sunshine today, the big headline for right now, but uh, tomorrow there's the snow. Beyond that, uh, things not quite as active in our weather, but maybe becoming a progressively warmer. Uh, we start seeing some 30s by the weekend and even by even early next week, flirting with a, a 40 degree potential, so something to get kind of excited about on a day when we are only 7 degrees in Rochester just before 9 o'clock. One below right now in International Falls, 12 in Sioux Falls, and 14 in North Platte, Nebraska. Here is Futurecast. Uh, the sunshine, here come the clouds from the west for the afternoon, increasing cloud cover. A little bit of a breeze around 15 miles per hour this afternoon, a high around 17. Temperatures will bottom out around 10, 11, 12 degrees this evening, and then they will begin to climb later on as warm air comes in ahead of the storm system. So a windier night with those south winds kicking in, pulling in the warmth, and then smart, uh, tomorrow, snow develops around 9, 10 o'clock in the morning, lasting until about uh, the evening commute. We're looking at maybe about 5, 6 o'clock in the evening, and then drying out late. Skies clear late tomorrow night, and then for Thursday, cold sunshine, lighter winds uh, t today and tomorrow. And uh, well, well, tonight and tomorrow looking kind of breezy, but Thursday light winds under high pressure, cold sun, and the temperatures uh, in the upper 20s uh, by Thursday afternoon. Today, here's what we're looking at for snowfall again for that Wednesday storm system, and uh, about an inch or so, maybe up to an inch and a half, perhaps approaching two inches, but an inch or more in the way of snowfall. The current outlook for Wednesday. Uh, for the rest of today, mostly sunny skies begin to cloud over in the afternoon. 17 in Rochester, Winona 20, 18 in Austin, 17 in Charles City uh, with those south winds picking up a little bit this afternoon up to 15 miles per hour. Tonight, windy. Winds really pick up later this evening. 
times reaching 30 miles per hour. So uh, feeling much colder than those temperatures will be. We're going to be in the teens overnight. Clouds uh, thickening. We'll have overnight lows, well, evening lows uh, around 11, but by tomorrow about 20. And then for a high temperature tomorrow afternoon around 28 southwest winds, especially early on the breezy side of the southwest, 10 to 20 miles per hour. Lighter winds by afternoon, an inch or two of snowfall overall. Seven day forecast snow tomorrow, then we get closer to the weekend. Rain and some snow mixing together as we look ahead at uh, Sunday afternoon. Maybe a little bit of rain, a little, a little bit uh, wet snow mixing in. Uh, Saturday night, maybe a minor coating it with that system as it then winds down Sunday morning. It'll be just a little bit above freezing by mid-morning and afternoon highs in the mid and upper 30s there. Another system by late Monday into Tuesday brings a couple of snowflakes, but mainly rain. Looks like the middle of next week might be in the low 40s with just rain for a while next week. Good old-fashioned November rain. Guns N' Roses fans, you knew it was coming back. We have to, we have to hope for a little November rain, a little more fall-like weather at any rate. Um, at any rate, uh, it's because right now we're kind of struggling uh, to see anything that's reminiscent of, of November because right now we're kind of in January or even December mode with these teens for highs and uh, sub-zero morning lows, sub-zero wind chills, things like that. Temperatures today, 25 degrees below the seasonal average for high temperatures. That's pretty cold stuff, but we are working our way in the right direction after today. In the meantime, have a great Tuesday, and we'll, we'll talk tomorrow again. Have a good day.